So this is a quick benchmark uh, review of the Galaxy S5 compared to the LG G2 um, and um, I'll just stop all the uh, running apps as you can see there are no recent apps and we'll go straight to um, Antutu which um, is right there so start Antutu And now we see already a rank there. There won't be a, a rank over here because it's, I just, you know, let's try it now and let's test. Yeah, so the uh, Galaxy S5 features a quad core processor, which is a Qualcomm Snapdragon 801 with 2.5 gigahertz. The LG G2 has a slightly older uh, Snapdragon 800 uh, CPU with also uh, 4 cores but uh, with 2.26 GHz. And it's really interesting because um, both have more or less the same hardware, 2 gigs of RAM um, uh, and a full HD display. And I'm really excited how much faster the Galaxy S5 with the new Snapdragon 801 CPU will be. So um, yeah, let's 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 have a look. So as you can see, the Galaxy S5 is finished already. It got uh, thirty-five thousand five hundred and seventy points. The LG G2 is slightly worse, but not much. It got. Um, 34,367 points, which is slightly beneath the Galaxy Note 3, and the uh, S5 is uh, slightly above the Note 3. So um, it's interesting that uh, such, well, it is a more a newer SoC, a newer CPU, but it's not that much of a difference. So um, if you're looking for, you know, uh, faster speeds, uh, you shouldn't uh, prefer the S5 because it's just not so much faster. Uh, we can offer this. Sometimes have higher frame rates. Um, the Galaxy S5 is definitely faster with 24,000 points. The LG G2 has just uh, 20,000 points. Um, probably in everyday life, you know, day-to-day -day, um, use, you won't notice that much of a difference. But it's still interesting that uh, a slightly new SoC is definitely uh, faster, at least in one benchmark. So um, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And leave a comment which one would you uh, choose, the Galaxy S5 or the LG G2. I'm Daniel from Tablet Bucky. Thanks for watching.